Legends, how are you doing guys? So today I just wanna share with you guys how to create some automation for your webinar. So for you um, that are running some kind of webinar, maybe weekly, maybe, I don't know, twice a week or whatever, um, this is gonna be a good automation that you can set up and it will help you to deliver the emails to uh, the people that will attend your uh, webinar and they're gonna have the link to join the webinar as well. So it's gonna be all automated. So uh, what I wanted to show you real quick is uh, how to create the automation. And it's super simple because um, this is actually a recipe. So it's uh, it's been created for you by Active Campaign. Uh, so all you need to do is come and come here, just uh, type webinar. This is the one that we want. So we're gonna select that. I'm gonna hit continue. And I really like this automation because um, it makes it super simple, but also what happened is, uh, depending on when they join the actual, um, you know, when, when they actually register for the webinar, they're gonna get different emails as well. So here you can put the trigger, um, so that's what we're gonna. That, that's that's gonna. Um, that's the trigger that will eventually, essentially, get them inside this automation, uh, and that can be done uh, later on. I will show you. So, alrighty. So, real quick through this automation, uh, they go, they register, they receive uh, straight away. You know, this email here saying, "Hey, uh, we're confirming that you have uh, joined the webinar." as in, you know, you registered. So if they have registered a week before, they're gonna get this email. However, if they registered, you know, the day before, you don't want them to get this email. So this is actually a goal. So it means that they will come in from the automation and they will automatically skip that bit and they'll go straight here. So a day before the webinar, they only get this one. If, um, if they're a little bit late for the party, and uh, they just uh, joined or registered the webinar um, in the day of the webinar itself, they will come and like, you know, join like straight like to this particular goal and they will just receive this email, right? So as you can see, it's pretty cool because, you know, it avoids a lot of uh, confusion. So they don't get emails they don't need to get. It's super personalized. So I've got a live event here. So it's similar, but for this one, it's just um, in the same day instead of like uh, a week before or a day before. So as you can see, you can actually customize everything. What is cool about that is um, that, like I mentioned before, um, they're gonna know the date of the webinar and they're gonna get the URL to join the webinar. And this is pretty much the magic, right? Because if they know the date and they have the, um, the, the link to join the webinar, like this, this is the biggest thing that they actually need. And that's that's how you're gonna make your life easier and their life easier because it's automated. So uh, this is like how the email is gonna look like. Um, and if you go inside here, this is actually the, um, the custom field. So to find out the custom field, you can just go to personalize. In this case, um, go to webinar, which is this one. When you go to personalize, for me, um, it's gonna be this particular you know, um, variable. So we're gonna copy this one and we're gonna paste that inside of the, um, uh, the URL. So that, that's gonna be the URL. So meaning that once they open their email address, they're gonna see this one instead, as in when they click, they're gonna to go to this link instead. So to get this information from um, the webinar software they're using to Active Campaign, you're gonna to need to use Zapier. So you go create an account, then uh, I'll walk you through. So for this particular example, we're using GoToWebinar. So you need to uh, configure the application. You're gonna say, every time I have a new registrant, I'm going to uh, send that to Active Campaign. So um, once you have these uh, particular automation set up and the Active Campaign one set up, all you need to do is to come here and select the one that you um, want to use. 
right? And that's all you need to do. Everything else is going to be done for you automatically. Okay. So, alrighty. So let's say you came here. I'm just going to walk you through and show you what else is happening here. So uh, once you select it here, it's going to show you the data. So how it looks like. So I actually did um, add myself. Um, and this is the, the URL to join this test webinar. And it's going to have the dating here as well. However, um, the date's going to be um, something like this, right? This is just an example, by the way, guys. So the date's going to be a, a crazy format like this. So then I used this guy, right, to the formata by Zapier or Zapier <laughs> to uh, find the date and change the date from this crazy format to this format, which is the format that Active Campaign needs to understand and run the automation. Cool. So then the last step is to send this data to Active Campaign. And what I did was I added it right here. So uh, when I have the upcoming webinar, I want you to send you know the date to this particular field for that particular uh, contact. And when I have the go to webinar join URL, that's you know the the URL that I want you to send. So it meaning it means that every time you've got a new person that comes in and register to the webinar, they're gonna get you know the date that uh, the webinar is gonna be happening for them, and also the URL that they would need to join the webinar. Cool, cool. So I just want to make a quick video, share that with you guys. Super powerful, super cool automation. If you guys get stuck and need any help, please let me know. We go from there. Take care. Bye-bye.